Hello friends, and welcome back to another episode of the Dirt to Daytona Career Mode series. It's been a while since I've been here. You can see that my background has changed, we actually just moved. I know the last episode of Dirt to Daytona just came out like a week ago, but I actually recorded that over two months ago, so it's been a while. I, uh, I don't know how well you can see the scar, but I had my wrist surgery. I've got two nice scars now. Um, surgery went well, recovery's going well, and uh, finally ready to record some more. So last episode we started off the new season with a race at Daytona. As you can see, we did not finish super well, but we weren't last and we made money. So, gotta look at the positives. Ward Burton was the winner of the race. Now, Ward drives the number 22 and we drive the number 22. That is a problem. So, let me show you how we fix that problem. So our team owner, John Q Racecore, sent over a nice letter to Bill Davis Racing. He said, congrats on your Daytona 500 win with Ward Burton. However, we noticed that you're running his car with the number 22 on it, which is our number. As you know, there can only be one number 22 car on the track, and we'd hate for anything bad to happen to you or your team. Let us know what you think. Now, the next day, our team got this letter back from Bill Davis Racing. They said, Race course stuff. Thank you for the congratulations. Unfortunately for Ward, we actually parted ways earlier this week. This means we will no longer be fielding the 22 entry from our team, so no need for any further action. So what happened to Ward? Let me show you. So Ward has moved over to the Haas CNC race team running the Net Zero number zero car. So we're the only 22 now. No more problems. Everything worked out fine. So our defending Daytona 500 winner is now with a new team. We keep our number 22 and all is well in the world. And with that, let's hop into the calendar, go to our next cup race, and see what we can do. So today's race will be at North Carolina Speedway. Let's see if we can uh, finish a little better than 41st. And as usual, I'm gonna run some practice before I, you know, do anything to the car and then uh, see how we look I also did move the camera down a little bit or like where my face cam is on the screen I moved down a little bit so it doesn't uh, doesn't block anything for you so hopefully that's in a, a good spot now it looks like we didn't rev over 7500 so we can definitely make a gear change for sure and this is one of those times where having some more motor would definitely help, but we'll get there later this season. I'm I'm sure of it. Ooh. Did not get on the brakes enough there. That is for sure. car also feels pretty stable, so I can probably loosen it up a little bit. Car high. Oh yeah. Sorry, Kurt. All clear. Definitely need to brake a little harder into, uh, into the first corner. That is for sure. So I made a gear change. I might have gone aggressive with it, might have not. I haven't really messed with the uh, gearing in the cup cars much yet, so we'll see. I also did drop the wedge a good bit, so we'll see what this baby does. Definitely seems to turn pretty well, but who knows how it'll do a few laps into the run. Alright, we gave the wall a nice little kiss there. Yep, 
Yeah, we're still very slow <laughs> compared to uh, some of the front runners like Jeff Gordon. But if we improve, that's all I can really ask for. Alright, so we got right about 8,000 RPMs. I still don't know where Redline is on this thing, so I'm going to mess with it a little more. Basically, my goal is to find where too far is with the gearing and then back it down. But I yeah, have uh, rifled it off a little too too deep into the corner there. Clear low. We just made a pass in practice. Oh my goodness. Compared to the Daytona run, we've already won this weekend. We haven't bettered our previous best lap time yet, but I'm sure... Oh, there we go. definitely have to stay out of the wall there that is uh, that is gonna gonna hurt me quite a lot if I can't fix that all right a little bit free but Carlo I can drive a car that's free Carlo I'm gonna make a little bit more of a gear adjustment and then uh, the car feels okay it's just slow so I might just qualify after that oh there's Ward his uh, nice new zero car Let's see where is Redline on this thing anyways okay so it's just over 8,000 so we're pretty close. I did do Carlo, one more gear adjustment. So, might have gone too far, but we'll see. All right, we just touched the shift light. I think we'll be okay right about there. I also added a little bit of grill tape, so I want to keep an eye on the on the oil tin. Did not run a very good turn one and two there. I feel like I get three and four pretty well because it doesn't require braking, but. One and two is a little more difficult for me. Oh, Carlo. come on, Kurt. You know what a back bumper costs, buddy? Still there. We did just run our fastest lap, so... I will say, I think the car is about as good as it's gonna get. Um... It'll be very interesting to see long run how we how we do here. Ooh. Little loose under braking. But hey, that was a that was a fast lap there. I feel feel pretty good about it. So I think the practice session went pretty well. Um I ran solid laps I even pass people in practice so like I said compared to Daytona we've already won for the weekend so uh, let's go ahead and qualify see uh, how we stack up to the rest of the back markers and uh, then we'll go run this race so based on the times I'm seeing we shouldn't be last That's that's very comforting. Go, 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 go.
I just gotta get a really good exit off of four here, and then I think we should have a solid lap. Let's just hope it sticks in one and two. did not stick in one and two. Oh well. This won't be our prettiest lap, but again, based on the times I was seeing, we're not last, which is better than Daytona. <laughs> Alright, let's see where we play. Yeah, 2569. I think we ran like a 2540 in practice, so could have been better, but as with most of my setups, the car gets better through the run. I don't run my best lap, you know, lap one or lap two, but let's see where we stack up. Hey, we qualified 22nd. We're on the outside though, which is not, not what we like, but seems to happen every single time in this career mode. But let's hop into the race. Under beautiful Carolina blue skies, welcome to the North Carolina Speedway, also known as The Rock. This one mile oval has been thrilling fans for over 30 years. With 22 degrees of banking and a tough on tire surface, you get fierce competition that gives The Rock its name. All right, let's go run North Carolina Speedway, The Rock. Get set, the race is going green. There's the green flag. Car low, car high. Ooh, we did not get car a very low. good jump there. Low. I think part of that has to do Go with clear. having low power. We have a very different gear set than most of the other teams. Oh boy, we've got 51 laps to run. This is gonna be exciting. Comment below now. Do you think we're going to make all 51 laps? Especially for sliding like that on lap number two. Um, my bet would be on no. Oh boy. You guys doing all right up there? You guys having fun? Oh, that's the apron. Okay, Hermie, you go ahead. So I think the setup we have is pretty solid. The car seems good, just slow. So um, it's not like really on edge or anything, but I cannot imagine we're going to finish. If we if we can finish top 20, I will. Uh... I'll be very happy what I was going to say. I guess that's not a yellow? Okay. Alright. What'd we... What'd we do to... Ah, uh, yes. Radiator damage, wheel damage. Those are the things I like to see. Awesome. Well. Still there. That's just peachy. All clear. That's just PG. Hey, look. There. Pitbull. Oh, the energy drink, not the musician. I'm gonna say maybe he was in NASCAR well before All he uh, helped co own track house racing. Oh, yeah, we are very loose under braking. And I am. Oh, that, that. Yep, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Nothing to see here, folks. Car's fine. Driver's fine. Everything's fine. Still can't believe they didn't throw a yellow. Like, I, I spun multiple times around and hit the wall. That's not a yellow. What is? What is? Look at us making a pass. 
Still there. All clear. Also, our right front is already over a third of the way worn through. That is not. Oh, is Mark? That's the leader. Oh, oh, did he save it? Okay, he saved it. Still, we're <laughs> we're like eight laps in, and we're getting lapped. Oh my goodness, this is going to be a struggle. Okay, Mark, that. You're three wide. Car high. Clear high. Yellow's out. Hey, look, they finally throw a yellow. Pace cars out. I I was I was a little upset about being run into. I have a feeling NASCAR is gonna call me to the hauler after this one. Well, the car looks fine. Front end has uh, maybe bumped into something, but other than that, the car is pretty much good to go. I am gonna go ahead and take this time to pit and made a slight air pressure adjustment. And yeah, we'll see how she does. Have I ever mentioned how fun it is to sit here through caution laps? Has that ever come up? Because if I said that, I was lying. I am... So bored. I just want to run into stuff again. Am I the only lap down car that's going into the pits? This game amazes me sometimes. Is uh, Mikey Waltrip crashed out? Interesting. We might not finish last. Let's go. Also, I wonder what kind of damage repair we have coming. Ah, eh, only 10 seconds. The bucket heads are at it again. Oh, the pace car's off, and we're still all the way back here. Love that. But hey, we're not last, so that's that's nice. Always love to see that. Oh yeah, lap down cars get to come up towards the front. Oh come on, give me green. Let me get a Kyle Busch start. Let's go. Car high. Look at us making passes. Oh, thanks thanks for the bottom line, guys. I do appreciate that. Oh, hi, Tony. All clear. Bye, Tony. Okay, 36 laps to go. It looks like we should be able to make it on one pit stop. It'll be interesting to see, with most people not pitting, if everybody has to pit twice, if there's more cautions. What what What's gonna happen? <laughs> okay. All right. Well, we're not going to pit, so this will be interesting to see what happens. Looks like Steve Park and Elliot Sadler had a tussle. Don't know what happened. Pace cars out. Okay. That was a great lap. <laughs> Just ran a great lap with the CPU controlling. Because <laughs> things go better when I'm not the one driving. I think I might be getting the wave around because it looks like everybody's pitting. Awesome. I think that's good. Unless it's going to start me right in front of the leaders. 
So if it does that, that's going to be really annoying. We'll see what happens, though. I think one lead lap car didn't pit because he just moved to the front of the line. So, uh, if we don't get our lap back because of one guy, that's what happens. I'm just going to dump him. Now it says Ward Burton's in first, even though he's behind me. And now I'm confused again. Yeah, it shows the 33 Mike Wallace behind me on the leaderboard, but it moved him in front of me. Yeah, see, I don't like that it says Ward Burton just led that lap, even though we were in front of him. But we're still behind the pace car. I don't know what's going on. The pace car is off. I'm, I'm staring at the pace car. Oh, goodness. So we're going to start out at the front of the line, but Ward Burton, who's in first, is two cars behind me. So wave rounds don't work in this game. Good to know. Love that. Love that. Get set. The race is going green. There's the green flag. Car low. Car high. Clear low. Clear high. Car low. Oh, hi, Jeff Gordon. So, Mike Wallace is on the same lap as us, but it started him on the bottom of the track and started me at the top of the track. Carlo. What in the world? Oh, I overcorrected because I was getting loose. Car high. All clear. Out. Car low. Why is the yellow out again? Pace cars out. This game is making me go nuts. How is it I'm able to make laps around here and not crash? Except for the time I crashed. But everyone else is crashing. I'm gonna pit. I don't know how many laps are left, but I'm going to pit here and I don't know. Maybe we'll get lucky and end up back on the lead lap or something. I have no clue what's going on. Okay, that's the halfway mark. So if we just hit halfway, then we've got 25, 26 laps to go somewhere in there. So, probably won't make it on one tank of fuel, but we're going to try. So, it has Ward pitting with the lap down cars, even though he's scored in the top 15. I am so confused. Okay, that's the halfway mark. Okay, that's the halfway mark. That's the second time they've said that. Cool. And I guess we have no damage repair time, even though the car is clearly damaged, but that's okay. Everything's fine. Good job, Bucketheads. Got me out in front of the other guys. But yeah, we're starting P bad. Yeah, let's give it up for 37. The pace car is off. Woo. Get set. The race is going green. There's the green flag. Oh, I thought I might get a run, but uh, that didn't happen. So we're still a lap down. 
I don't know where my buttons are. Okay, we've got 19 laps to go. Still there, car high. There's no way this race goes caution free. It's impossible. Slow down. You're all clear. I promise I wasn't trying to pit, buddy. Oh, yep. Yeah, I know. I was the spin and turn too. Thanks, guys. Well, this is fun. I'm having fun. Things are great. We are gonna pit. That is for sure. know what else to do to this thing every time I adjust the tire pressure it still runs awful and we're slow like even if this car has the perfect setup we're still slow what a bummer from starting 22nd to where we're at now such a bummer so it looks like we're in the final pit window so I think everybody's pitting now. Got another 10 seconds of fixing on this thing. What a wrecked bucket of junk. At least the bucket heads earned their money today. Well, like the fourth pit stop. The pace car is off. Get set. The race is going green. There's the green flag. All right, passing all the lead lap cars, all which all clear. doesn't help me at all. So I tighten the car up a bunch just to try to keep it from sliding and uh, we're gonna hope oh Carlo. okay that Clear was high. that was ridiculous Give me some room. Don't. Car no. low. Clear low. Why was that a good idea? Clear high. Car high. Clear low. All clear. Like, we're faster than some guys. We're not like car the high. slowest car out here, but goodness gracious, this is painful. I will definitely be saving up for motor upgrade to be our next our next purchase. All clear. Cause we're never gonna win a race being this slow. Like, if I can't press the gas pedal off the corner and pass people. Still there. Clear low. All clear. There's a wreck in turn two. Car low. Is there? Because I was in turn two and I didn't see a wreck. Are you sure about that? Oh, it looks like Newman's in the pits. Interesting. Ah, we have engine damage again. Love that. Not sure how that happened. I mean, I'm sure it's from me running into people, but like, wouldn't we have radiator damage too? 
Just seems silly, doesn't it? Carlo. Carlo. Remember when I was talking about hoping go. for a top 20? Yeah, that was funny, wasn't it? The yellow's out. Another yellow Space flag. Or what? So do I pit and lose like eight spots, but fix the car? Yeah. yeah I'm going to. The pace car is off. Get set. The race is going green. There's the green flag. Car high. All right, eight laps to go, 38th place. Still there. You're all clear. We were in 29th before we pit, but I know we would have had a pretty high repair bill with the engine damage, so my hope is Still there. at least by pitting, we can maybe profit some money by having less expenses. Stay low. Still there. Hopefully, with the repaired car, I can make some passes. Car high. Stay low. Still there. Come on. Slow down. Car high. Five laps to go. You're all clear. Clear high. Oh. You upset the car bad when you hit me, but we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. So we're back up to 30th. We were 29th. So even if we finish a spot worse with all the damage we fixed, we, you know, we'll have less money spent, so. Still there. I'd say overall, All clear. pitting was a good call. Still there. All clear. Oh, buddy. Clear high. Oh, buddy. We're fine. Car's fine. Everything's fine. So we're passing guys that aren't even on the same lap as us, so we definitely had some speed, just did not have the best circumstances. Last lap. Still there. Definitely a bummer, but All clear. at least we can take some positives from the race weekend. Now let's also hope our bank account is a positive from the race weekend. But hey, top 30. We'll get him next time. For how the first part of this race went, I'd say we did all right. For sure. Oh well, and now we're wrecking. So here are the results for today's race. Dale Jarrett gets the win. We unfortunately finished a lap down in 29th. But when you look at how the first part of this race went, I feel okay with that. Obviously would have liked to finish better, but it is what it is compared to Daytona. A lot, lot better. We actually showed some speed, just had some issues. So I just have to drive better. That's that's really the big thing. And now for the fun part. We see if we made money or if things went bad. 
So unfortunately, we did have a lot more expenses and ended the day in the red just a little bit though. So I think give it a, a few races, but we might be able to, uh, even these not so great finishes, might be able to turn those into positive things. What a race. Of course, Tail Jarrett took the checkered flag. We could have done better. I know it. You know it. We'll try again next week. And the race results show we moved all the way up to 39th in the season standings. We're so close. I think our goal is top 25. And only 80 points you know the same amount of points we scored today so definitely have our work cut out for us to continue uh, moving up the standings board but gotta start somewhere and look at that we finally got sponsor offers so that is going to do it for another episode of the dirt to daytona career mode series I just want to say a big thank you to everybody who's watching these. Uh, you know, if you can, hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave me a comment if you got anything to say. And I hope I catch you in the next one. See ya.